how's it everyone welcome back to the channel hope you're all having a great day if you are new or it's your first time checking me out then please do hit that like and subscribe button as well as the bell icon for all future vlogs that will come out i really appreciate that so in today's episode i've come to realize that i haven't done a proper introductory vlog and i mean i've been doing this for quite a while so yeah i'll be looking at that for today and just give you guys a bit of a run on as to who i am So for those of you that don't know, my name is Carlisle, I'm from Alsis River in Cape Town, um, if you're international then that's based in South Africa, and I drive a 98 Honda Prelude 5th Gen, I've called the car Red Riding in the Hood, based on the colour of the vehicle, um, from the factory it's actually Ruby Red Pearl, but I had a respray done about 5 or 6 years ago, and I had a bit of toner added to the color so that I could have a custom shade made and it is now border red pearl so basically when the car is in low light it appears to be a dark wine red and in better lighting conditions or normal daylight then the ruby red still pops through um, yeah the car is still pretty much factory wise other than running a competition clutch stage 2 as well as a 57 mm stainless steel exhaust system and for the rest of the modifications I've got the Mugen replica side skirts as well as the rear valances with a custom rear Jace diffuser um, also running the G ready or Grady front lip with a custom universal splitter in the front as well and what else is there oh yeah Do not forget that Mugen wing uh, and for the wheels I am rolling on a set of 18 by 9.5 uh, Avid 1 working motion CRK replicas as well as having a set of Enkai uh, Mitsubishi Evo wheels that I will be custom coloring and then fitting onto the car as well in future I've still got my OEM 5th uh, gen blades uh, it's supposed to be the daily wheels, but at the moment I'm still rolling on the Avid ones uh, for daily. So yeah, uh, other mods include the PC racing coilovers, as well as the Star Sports air cups that I'm actually the supplier of here in South Africa as well. So apart from the car, I also daily a 2006 Honda Fireblade CBR 1000RR and in the next few scenes i'll be doing a quick walk around of the motorbike then following from that i'll be uh, inputting some content that i have when i go to pick up my repair g ready lip uh, for those of you that don't know i had an incident with a transport carrier uh, you'll see on one of my previous vlogs where the lip was actually damaged while brought down from Joburg back to cape town after the nazarek german was a chap show and then I'll just do some cinematics of where wood is currently being resprayed as well. So yeah, let me get to that and I will check back with you guys a little bit later. And this is the daily. As I mentioned, CBR 1000RR, uh, 2006 Fireblade. Bought this about three years ago. Still using daily. I haven't had any issues with this baby excuse uh, the dirt the dust and whatever else you're seeing on the bike i haven't washed it we had some musty and rainy weather recently and yeah with me using it daily there's just no time to do that but hopefully this weekend i'll be able to sort it out and then you'll be looking clean and as good as new What's really unique about this one, there are only three models that I have seen locally that instead of having the Honda decal here, they've got the Fireblade decal and that is as Honda made it from the factory. And then some other nice touches are Fireblade logo in the wheels as well as these reflector strips.
Made it to Ronaldo so we can pick up the repair G really love. I've been waiting for this and really looking forward to see the repair product. And I'm certain Ronaldo has heated out of the park with that repair job. So let me just go inside and meet up with him. And then I will show you guys how the lip looks now that it's been fixed. And Mr. Swat himself. Oh, and already that looks super, super awesome. Yeah. How are you, sir? How are you, sir? Good, good, thanks. Good day. Call out. Call out. Call out. come to the end of another episode hope you guys enjoyed the content i must say that wood is looking good i'm very happy with the prep work that has been done so far um, yeah in the next one i'll be making a turn again at rnm and hopefully we'll be able to get some more cinematics of what she's looking like with the color applied so yeah looking forward to that also then got a couple of small items that are arriving for robin's chairs so i'll include that in the next episode um, but until then guys hope you have a good one remember your goals your rules Stay motivated. Until the next one guys, cheers. <laughs>